What you doing? You're playing ki your sucky, sucky bag, whatever. Sucky bag. <laughs> Kicky bag. <clears throat> sucky bag. What the freak? That does not sound right. Oopsies. What is going on guys, it's Peta Bread, and welcome back to another episode of my Let's Play for The Sims 3, The Life of Peta and Katniss. Um, this is episode... Uh, 15? 14? 15? I don't remember, but um, I think it's the 15th episode. Correct me if I'm wrong. But um, apparently, a fire has started right when I was about to start the episode, and apparently someone uh, left their food in the oven without checking back onto it. So, uh, yeah, let's go. Um, actually, people haven't discovered the fire yet. Um, let's hope. Let's hope Katniss doesn't figure it out. Um, nope. They, they found out there's a fire. They found out. Actually, you can try to extinguish it yourself. I don't I don't think there's a big problem with that. That's probably gonna mess up your mood, though. We'll see. Alright, so they saved the day. Insurance is granted 1,639 to cover the loss from the fire. Wow, thank you so much for that. I have to spend my money to fix that again. Who freaking... Use my oven, did not check their food, now it's just uh, broken. Alright, go eat your salad. You can go eat your salad too. Don't bother trying to make food at the moment. That was a close call. Good job extinguishing the fire before you could arrive. Be careful to not start fires at your house. Well, we didn't do it. Somebody else did it. Stupid. Hey, but it was this guy. He's a jock, level 6. Alright, so I figured out what I wanted to do for this episode, and that was to get more into the social groups, because that's what um, University Life brought. And um, I think we should start getting into more of those groups because once you level up through those uh, the social groups, you get more activities to do. And um, I think I'd, I've never leveled up my social groups that much, so let's try to do that this time. Let's do something new for for me at least. But I made a, f a minor adjustment to Peta's hair. It's brown now. It was black before. Now it's brown, just like Katniss's hair. You know? Okay, they're both like competing to clean up the dishes here. Wow. Alright, so what I want um, Katniss to get more into is the rebel one and um, Peta to get more into the nerd. Katniss is like level 2 and nerd already because she's been playing so many games. So I'm going to have Peta um, play some games as well, but he has class in a little bit, I think. Right? Friday, you go at 12 p.m. So we won't have a lot of time, but let's just, I guess we'll just do it anyway. So I'm going to have him, um, let's see, ooh, make exam cheat sheet. Can we do that? Is that to rebel and Katniss can well you can clean up this dish here we'll put oh that's gross that one's spoiled too yeah clean that up and you can get ready for class since you are like really stinky yep he got back into the nerd social group now and that's that's pretty good we need that so we just have to be very consistent with these because if we don't then obviously they kick us out it's good that we can rejoin it just by doing the activities, you know? Oh gosh, did she just clog the toilet? Oh gosh, she had a big freaking log of poop or something. I'm just kidding. <laughs> That's nasty. Alright. I didn't know she was already going to use the bathroom herself. Oops. But they tend to do that when they really need it. So let's get a nice shower going on. Have PETA continue to level up his nerd. I don't even know if there's like an, a, a bar for it to show you how much progress you're making within the social groups. But what I'm going to do now is I'm also going to get... Actually, let's take a look at our lifetime, our potential lifetime awards that we can buy for the moment. What about fast learner? Is there a fast learner somewhere? Should be fast learner somewhere. I don't know, did I pass it already? I think I passed it. No. I don't see it. Yeah, I can't see it. I, uh, either I'm blind or I can't. It's okay. There. It, okay, here it is. Fifteen thousand. So, right now we're gonna go and buy some substantial amount of influence within the nerd. We're gonna buy this because we're just cheap like that. I just exchanged some lifetime happiness for influence of the nerd social group. I feel very clever. He's now cool with the uncool within the nerd social group, and yeah. Being a part of the nerd group has its advantages, and they've shown Pita Bread a hack to unlock the ability to play online on game consoles. The nerd is also a place where we have already achieved that because Katniss did that. And he has, they both have exams uh, in 7 days, so now he's level 3 within the social group. That's, that's cool, that you can buy experience with that. Go to class. And somebody else clogged another toilet. It wasn't me! 
I don't think it was me. Yep, it wasn't. It wasn't neither of them. Alright, both of them have to go now. Gosh, who's calling? When we get there, we'll just pick it up. Okay, pick it up now. Who is it? I have to go to class, man. Hey, Peter, you gotta have a... You gotta have a bachelor party before you get married. Bachelor party? I know they're gonna get married eventually, but should we do it right now? Can we? Will we still have that opportunity to throw a bachelor party if we don't accept it right now? I want to do it though. We have the mission common look to get to know you. Oh, you look like a freak. Whatever your name is, I don't even know your name. So they're at class, so let them do that. I'm gonna have um, big professor for a good score. Whoa. Hmm. Let's try to beg. Katniss is kind of persuasive, isn't she? I don't know. And we'll have Peter work hard. Actually, you know what? I'll have her try hard too. There's no point in begging. You can get turned down, I think, quite easily. So we'll just have her work hard because work working hard does pay off eventually, no matter what. Katniss Everdeen nailed the quantitative models and culpability 102 exam and passed with flying colors. Nice. Peter Brad nailed the revolu a revolution. Of carbon tree 102 exam and passed with flying colors. Nice, they both passed their exams. That is awesome. I didn't even realize that exams today, but uh, they seem stressed out now. So, Katniss, you can uh, go home. Um, yeah, flying colors. Awesome. Good job, guys. See, working hard does pay off, and their like uh, performance bars are quite high. Oh wait, they don't have performance bars anymore. Huh? Oh, that's interesting. She only has 3,000 points. I don't know if I want to save that for something else. But I'm going to give her some rebel influence. Let's just purchase that. Alright, so I'd rather buy influence with the rebel social group rather than earn it. I feel so rebellious. Wow, yeah, that is actually quite rebellious. She's now a line crosser within the rebel social group. It's a long and winding road to becoming the top rebel. So Candace Everdeen's friends gave her a street art bag and a megaphone to kick things off. For some spare simoleons, Candace can sell stolen exam answers too. Holy moly! Can we actually do that? Sell some exam answers? Um, is it are an artsy type of? Yeah, I don't care about that. We could have easily repaired the computer ourselves, but I'm just too lazy for that. All right, see, I'm too rebel, too much of a rebel to do that. So let's go check our job board, and we're gonna see the social group jobs. Um, I wanted to see if we can actually sell some exams answers for money. The dumpster is a treasure chest full of great finds and you never know what the stinky box will yield. Take a dive, what will you find? And we will gain rebel influence from that. I'm gonna have her dumpster diving because why not? Where is a dumpster at? I need to find a dumpster. Okay, there are usually dumpsters by these usually by these buildings, right? Yeah, there should be. Yeah, there's one right here. Let's go to this one. I think there's one closer, but who cares? Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, this is the closest one, right? What you doing? You're playing ki your sucky, sucky bag, whatever. Sucky bag. <laughs> Kicky bag. <clears throat> sucky bag. What the freak? That does not sound right. Oopsies. Don't make fun of me. Gosh, dang it, guys. How dare you? Oh yeah, do it. We don't have to pay bills here, do we? Yeah, we don't. Obviously, we don't. All right, I'm gonna see what kind of jobs he is gonna get offered from his uh, social group. We have some, okay, so many people are hitting on these sims here. Uh, the matchmaker was found by Katniss Everdeen while dumpster, wall she found a freaking couch. A nasty one, probably. Um, no, I don't want to do something rebelish. I want to do a nerd social group. Jock, no, I don't want to do that. Let me get a nerd one. There we go. Social gaming at its finest at the Keefe's Comics with a room full of nerds. Head on over and earn some respect with the nerds. So we have to go visit Keefe's Comics and play video games. That can be... That's easy. We can do that right now. Is this it? Keefe's Comics. Alright, go there. Go there. Go be a nerd. Right, she's still dumpster diving. Oh gosh. She found a clock. Interesting. Did she finish her job? Yep. Alright, we're at Keefe's Comics now. I remember this place, I think. Yeah, I really like it. Wow, look at all these nerds. Ooh. A whole bunch of nerds. Happy hour is over. Make sure you're here again tomorrow. Oh yeah, you can also get some food here. It's like a it's like a best hangout. Great place for nerds. Alright. So let's have him play this game here. We'll play the arcade table with somebody. Let's do with uh Garrison Forty. Fort. 
Gosh dang it, why did I think that was an eye? The colors were too bright, I can't see. <laughs> Excuses. Alright, so we've increased Nerdix influence. Nice. Yay. Keep on doing that, guys. Oh, he's here to repair the showers too. Nice. Thank you. Am I saying nice too much? I think I'm saying nice too much. Ooh, mac and cheese. Someone just repa uh, prepared this, so let's go eat it. Alright. We also got a megaphone, right? I heard we got a megaphone. Yeah, we can proclaim love. Oh my. Rant about people. Announce protest at. Uh, it's too late for that. Let's not do a protest right now. Maybe tomorrow we'll try to do a protest. Why don't you go eat? Oh, why is she vomiting? What the flip? Did she get food poisoning? <laughs> What's going on, Katniss? Are you pregnant? We don't know about it when you guys woohoo and you accidentally got pregnant? I don't know. Looks like I'm all done here. That'll be 50 simoleons. Wow, you fixed two things. You fixed a shower and our computer for 50 simoleons. Nice. Look at that. I love this place. It just feels very cozy and kind of... I don't know. Did you just break that one? Oh my gosh. And I thought you were a level 10 nerd and knows who does his stuff. Oh, I forgot to start my timer. Oopsies. Oh, this guy's a fairy. With very little wings. Look at your little wings. Wow, look at little baby wings for you. Ha. Huh. What's this? Oh, it's a little box sculpture thingy. Unopened um, toy figurine. The This is called the uh, the Big Nose Big Circle figure. 1025. 3000. With automatic hand sizzling features. Steaming nose dripping snot thing and a biodegradable <laughs> I don't know what I don't know have you guys ever seen like shows like that where they describe every type of like spe specification for a certain model that's hilarious I find that hilarious for some reason and I just mocked it oopsies I don't know <laughs> whenever someone's an expertise at something and they're trying to introduce something to someone they're like they tell you all about it to make it sound all i don't know fancy turbo jet skis <laughs> i don't know i'm sorry guys i'm a little weird i'm always weird okay he's hungry too so let's have him eat that mac and cheese <laughs> broke college student life you're eating basic food like noodles or mac and cheese you know that that stuff Oh, uh, we're watching TV. I want them to uh, interact with each other a little bit more. So before they go off to bed, they're going to talk to each other. Yeah, he's like done eating now. I'm not going to clean it up though. Someone else can do that. Let's go here and we're going to have them talk to each other. Just talk about their day and stuff, you know. Uh, let's do friendly. Ask about the day. Because why not? We want to be nice like that. <clears throat> he looks... Uh, I think the brown hair suits him a little bit more. What did you guys prefer? The black hair or is it the brown hair that looks a lot better on him? I think brown's okay. I think both were a fine. Both were a fine. She is our fiance. We gotta, we gotta interact with her here and there. Let's do some romantic stuff. Let's uh, ask to be protected. Why not? You wanna protect me, huh? Make a promise to protect. She'll protect us. We'll protect her. Cause I mean, obviously, we're destined to be together forever. So let's uh, ask to watch the stars. Let's do something romantic here. Spend some quality time together, you two, cause you need it, I guess. So they're gonna go watch stars together. Oh God. Oh, okay. I forgot that my art, my art stuff was out here. I thought that was like vomit for a second. I don't know why, but yeah. Hey, wouldn't it be better if you guys were laying in the grass? Uh, I mean, I don't know. Is this a good spot for it? You have like a, okay, whatever. I'm not gonna question it. Okay, they're slowly transitioning into that. Why are you hungry? I thought you just ate. <laughs> I thought she just ate, literally. Oh, she, she didn't eat though because she was vomiting, so. Okay, I'm gonna stop. Sorry, Peta. We we watched a little bit at least. At least we got to do it. 
Oh god, they're like tired. Obviously. Oh god, paparazzi, get away from me! I'm going to sleep now. Oh,